The Domino Lady, a masked manhunter prowling the penthouses and sound stages of 1930s Hollywood. The following morning in the lobby of the El Cortez Hotel. I got a telephone call telling me where to retrieve the million dollar bill. I suppose the Domino Lady thought it was too hot to hold on to after Mr. Carly phoned the police. Maybe she knew you were on her trail. The Domino Lady was here. She tried to extort money from me in exchange for the one million dollar note. You shouldn't have roughed up those suspects. I'll rough you up, but good. Page three, right? Uh, it's the only one I got left. For you, page three, for <laughs> Ellen and myself. What will happen now that the slimy Dan Carly is in charge of the exposition? And now that Roger McCain has been caught two-timing with his old girlfriend in disguise? And what kind of violence is being done to me there? I'm... <laughs> it ends up sounding better. Okay. Oh, I get that. I know what that means. <laughs> what is it now? No, I'm going to take it from oh, the very, sorry. very top. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello, Mr. McCain. My, but you look handsome. Posing for your photographers and all. And actually, if we're gonna do scene three, uh, we need to have Peter in here. There have been financial problems surrounding the expo, not the least of which is the friction between Dan Carley and Samuel Benton. Ellen, that isn't safe. There's certain to be guards here tonight. I know, Dottie, but I must look for clues on my own. You don't shut your filthy mouth. Then I'll continue to say objectionable things, and you will be powerless to stop. <laughs> Just do that again. <laughs> Close enough that I could reach out and touch her. And I did. Shall I prepare your evening clothes, Miss Patrick? Yes, Dottie. The mask and cloak with it. But remember, you've got all the power because you're the one who's got the gun. Yes. It's that simple. Don't ask for it by name. Except in New York City. Shh.